it comes to the new year, there are certainly some ideas and thoughts that can hold you back. So how do you get past these gracefully? Well, Dougal Fraser, psychic and life coach extraordinaire, is here to tell us how to present a new year and a new you. I like yeah. extraordinaire. I Thank know. you. As I toss my hair. We threw that That's in there lovely. just for you. Okay, so it's a new year. I feel like people are always full of these just like, let's just be honest, these bullcrap resolutions. Absolutely. But sometimes those resolutions can hold us back because we don't let go mm. of the year before. Well, right? so here's the thing, you know, everybody thinks with the psychic that your entire life is written in stone, and unfortunately it's not. We have certain strengths and weaknesses that keep repeating as patterns in our life. So as the new year, when everyone's focusing on changing their energy, it's a great time to set your intention. Now, most people use resolutions. I want to lose weight, I want more money, I want to attract. What you're telling God in the universe is if I get this, I will feel better. So do you think resolutions then sometimes work against us? Totally, because you're saying, I don't have enough, I'm less than, and like attracts like, that's and that's, that's what you're true. going to attract. That's true. So I shifted around. If you want to lose weight, what about being fit and healthy? What can right. you do today to attract that energy? Then you'll attract more. If you want more money, it's not about money, it's about feeling productive, it's mm -hmm. about feeling, feeling and safe, creative. and creating that in the now. Because right. the work is not your source of the money. Exactly. And money doesn't really solve solve anything. No. What people want is they mo want money, mo more money, more money. Right, right. But what they want is security. We look about something behind it. So what I tell people to do is look at the emotional core. What's the structure and energy you're looking for? When you connect with that, like attracts like and you'll bring more to you. Mm. Right. Got I it. love that. So yeah. it makes so much sense. It really does. Now, and do when you look to security, there is no such a thing. Exactly. Is there? I no. mean, you're a psychic and you know this. There is no <laughs> such thing. Well, it's the, the mind gets attached to certain things will make us feel a certain way. If right. I buy Buy these shoes, I will feel better. Now, sometimes I that's mean, true. Let's be honest. <laughs> but, but the truth is, it's not the shoes. Right. You know, it's the idea that the shoes gives us a sense of confidence. Then we walk in, we carry a certain kind of energy. <laughs> Do you understand? A good pair of shoes makes your legs look amazing. I am a gay man. <laughs> My shoes today were specifically picked out for you. <laughs> Shall but your Shall socks and my right. socks, right, right. Yeah. Well, so you yeah. did a spectacular job. <laughs> now, are you are you not are you saying that we should not like set goals and projections for the new year? Because I kind of like to go into the new year with a clean slate and go, okay, here's what I did last year. I'm good with what I did, or I'm not good with what I did. How can I make things better? Let's make a list. That's perfect. You're not approaching it from a lack. People go into the new year thinking, I don't have a certain thing, or I'm not a certain way, and mm -hmm. I need to fix that. I'm telling you to focus on what you're great at, what energy makes you feel the most connected to who you are, mm -hmm. and that's how you attract abundance, Because you said prosperity. like attracts like. like good, exactly. good, if you put good stuff out there, then you attract there, good stuff. If exactly. you put negative energy and I did it and I can't, then you won't and you... You already you enter the new year feeling like a failure. I want you to feel your absolute best. Mm -hmm. So what makes you feel connected? I talk about designing the perfect day. That day where your hair feels great, you love your outfit, <sighs> everything goes well. What what elements do you need to be that person? A and that's how you attract <laughs> and a makeup artist. And that's how you attract the day that you're looking for. And you know, a joyful and prosperous mm. life. Now, Jingle, you you've done this. You've done this for for a while. And for maybe our new viewers and some of our newer markets, they don't, um, they haven't seen you on our show before. So tell us how you got started in this whole psychic life co life coach world. Well, my parents said by the time I was standing in the crib, I would talk about seeing colors around people. And my mom was like, Oh my God, he's chosen. And my dad right. was like, He's crazy. <laughs> Um, and sent me to therapy very, very quickly. But I do see color and energy around people. Like when I look yes. at you, yeah, you, you have this soft blue around you. Now, blue is someone that will say absolutely anything. <laughs> which, which, let's be honest, is sometimes lovely and it's sometimes, sometimes a little disconcerting. So what yeah. would you think my birth sign is? I have absolutely no idea. I'm not an astrologer. <laughs> Are you a, see, that's the thing. That means nothing to me. Oh, I, I work with energy and color, and, and that's how it works with me. So when you yeah. were a baby, you used to were seeing colors. I was, yeah. Around people. Yeah. Well, what color do you see around Dawn? She has pink. Pink Which light is light of perfection and unconditional love. She can be a little bit critical of herself. All Which is the funny time. though. You're oh. too forgiving of other people, but totally. really hard on yourself. To the nine. Guys, it's a gift. I don't own oh it. Oh my God. So what is Amy's? Oh. Amy has a really, really soft white and peach. This is a confusing color. So peach <laughs> is about flow. If things aren't flowing, yes. it really bothers you. Yeah. Even, you are a person of structure. Even if you go into somebody's house and you feel like it's cluttered, that will start driving you insane. Like everything has to flow. If it doesn't flow, it's not working for you yeah. and you need to change the situation. I like huh. that. Yeah, can we, very calming. When, when we come oh. back, can we come back, Stuart, and talk is about Courtney's color? Yeah. I, 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 well, we're going to need a whole segment for Courtney's color. We need to box our crayons. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, stay with us. We're going to be back.
back with more um, from Psychic Google Fraser when we continue. Don't go anywhere.